how are both of you doing today? Hi, Sharonda. Hey, great, Sharonda. How you doing? I am doing good, but I need to know when is this soundtrack dropping? Because Come Back Home is a bop, and I need the rest of the album. It is a bop. I've been Thank waiting. You. Thank I've been you waiting. so much. Sophia, can we speed this up? Can we get it out? Please? I think, guys, we have five days, July 29th, almost. <sighs> okay, just a couple more sleeps. Yes. I love your background, by the way. This is like yeah. as they look very familiar. I'm just gonna say, like, they're my parents, okay? <laughs> <laughs> my parents, yeah. this was their love story. I'm just saying. Yeah. Oh, thank you. But one of the things that I really enjoy about this film is it's not just a like romance. It's so many different issues that we're tackling between contract marriages, what does recovery look like, and also too, most importantly, about what healthcare looks like of the affordability for everyone. So I really wanted to know the importance of actually having these messages in the film. How did that actually speak to you and push you further than just, than just being this is a romance film? It truly was the reason that I fell in love with this project because it was so much more than a love story. It was a love story with deeply important social political messages, starting with, you know, the heart of Cassie and Luke's relationship, which is basically a metaphor of the division in this country between red and blue. And finally seeing each other as human beings and choosing love first and foremost. And then, of course, the issue of healthcare and type 1 diabetes and the insulin crisis, which is immensely important, the issue of immigration, um, the military. There were so many incredibly social political issues um, that needed to be told that our story does so beautifully. And Liz, our incredible director, was so careful to make sure that they were all told with honesty and truth. And um, I hope that we accomplished that. You did. Yeah. How about you? <laughs> yeah. I'm sorry. Yeah, uh, yeah. I agree with everything. Uh, no. Uh, um, yeah. I, I. I. I agree. I. Um. I think. Um. That we don't claim to like solve uh, or, or provide necessarily an answer to any sort of large question in this movie. But I think one thing we we feel like we've done successfully is kind of present uh, an alternative um, of. of um, you know, compassion, uh, different sides um, of, of the same coin, I think, um, that, that a lot of people are in, in the US. But there, there was just there was just so much um, meat in the script, I think, um, outside of the love story to, to, to really get involved with, you know, me personally, the military aspect was really fascinating. But as you said, you know, a, a young man in recovery, um, how that um, the ripple effect of, of, of that and how it affects all the people around you as well. Um, it was it was particularly fascinating but um yeah but look I'm one of the questions I love asking actors because you know when we watch these movies we go on a journey I was bawling my eyes out the whole time but <laughs> I want to know for you like after participating in this film and working on it going through the training um how has this changed you not only as a person but also too how has this changed you as a performer well, what, one thing I, I, I have to say as well is I, I feel like, you know, Sophia and I both had to go to some like pretty dark places, dark places for this because there, there, there were oftentimes days, I mean, most me, of our days. Yeah, well, exactly. I mean, it, it was actually quite funny how incredibly light yeah. our film set and our crew was considering yeah. how difficult the yeah. subject matter was. I mean, Absolutely. yeah, there was one, one day in, in hospital where um, I had spent sort of basically five hours, five, six hours not moving from the bed and it was pretty much endless crying. Sophia um, so beautifully and accurately, I think, uh, portrayed this young woman going through through diabetes. And, and I, I know that must have been draining for her as well. I'll let, I'll let you speak on that, Sophia. Um, yeah, it was, um, it was pretty extraordinary to have to go to those places. Um, but like Nick said, we were, we were kind of in there together and um, we trusted each other to go there. And I, for one, do feel very much changed as a performer and as an artist after this film. And um, I think I grew quite a lot from this and I learned so much from Cassie and from our story and from Liz and also as my experiences being on the production side of things and the writing of the soundtrack and, you know, every aspect of it, it really felt like, you know, a step for me and, um, I don't know. I remember Nick and I would text that week after we wrapped shooting. It was such a weird feeling of like letting go of this life that we had lived and these characters that we had like really stepped into. And um, I think 
we you know we're both hopefully changed for the better since since this film. Also, I just have to also compliment um, Liz Allen, our, our director, because yeah. I think she was very much uh, uh, an integral part in terms of just like okay. letting us yeah. go there and perform pushing there. Us, like putting yeah. us, like pushing us so gently and. It's almost like you wouldn't realize it and all of a sudden you went to this place you didn't think that you could go to like I remember that scene that you mentioned at the hospital. It was remarkable like I remember when they first wheeled Nick in. I felt like it was loot like it was Nick who had come back injured from war like it was traumatizing to see and to witness but that's kind of you know the world that we lived in Liz really led us and wanted us to go there. See now I gotta go watch it again. <laughs> good i just want to thank the both of you so much for taking time out of your day to speak with me i appreciate it so so much and i'm just sending nothing but love and light both your ways i hope you have a great day received thank and sending you. it right back thank you i receive it thanks sure i appreciate it